Hi, welcome to my tutorials on Euclid's Elements, Book 3. This video presentation is going to be on Proposition 12 of Book 3, which states that if we have two circles external to each other that touch at the point A, where F is the center of the circle B and G is the center of the circle E, then if we join the lines F and G, it will cross through the point A, like that. Now we're going to demonstrate this by contradiction. In other words, we're going to assume that F and G, the center of the circles, are not exactly where they're shown in this diagram, and that the line FG intersects the two circles at the points C and D. So now, with a little bit of imagination, F is the, is the center of the circle B, and G is the center of the circle E. Now, AF is equal to FC because they're radii of the same circle, and GA is equal to GD, again because they're radii of the same circle, and we have that GF is equal to GD plus this little bit CD plus CF. So here is our equation for GF. Now if we look at the triangle FAG the sum of FA plus AG will be greater than the third line, FG, according to Proposition 20 of Book 1. So we have AG plus AF is greater than GF. However, again, AG is equal to GD, and AF is equal to FC, so we have GD plus FC is greater than GF. So GD plus FC is greater than this whole line here. However, we know that GF is actually equal to GD plus this little bit CD plus CF. So we have GF is less than GD plus FC or GF is greater than GD plus CD. So in other words, we have a contradiction right here. And because we have this contradiction, we have demonstrated that FG must pass through the point A. And that concludes this video presentation. To see the next presentation, just click the next button.